Look at that. Those are tubes. That's a framework for a canopy or a carport. I guess it's called a carport. Have you heard of VersaTube? Well, that's what that is. And I'll be putting it together. And But this is just a sneak preview of the VersaTube. And uh, these tubes are uh, pretty cool. They're, you can pretty much have them made almost any way you want. Uh, but this is the, the framework, comes in nice little sections, so it's easy to actually transport. This is a little harder to tell, but this here is the roof to the VersaTube. It's all sealed up, but this VersaTube is going to be 14 by 36 and 12 feet tall. And so... We just hauled everything on here. That was there. That board right there and that one right there is, had all those tubes on it. And then there was another one down there. We had some two tubes laying across there just because the length of it. But yeah, it easily, it was overall, it's a thousand pounds and uh, pretty easy to, uh, to transport. So how do you anchor? this versa tube well a little upside down this is the base and then there's legs that sit on that base the holes that are in this base it's like a Lego set it's kind of cool the holes you have a choice of this 30 inch rebar with literally a washer on top welded and then dipped I would suggest if you can weld or you know someone to weld just do your own one of these tell them you're going to put it because these are ideal for putting it into dirt so you don't need to put it on asphalt because you pound that 30 inches into the ground and that in theory should hold you can also put like a one foot cube of cement and then pound it, well, pound it through with a one foot piece of cement anchoring it in. Or this guy right here. Some of you may have already seen this guy. This guy is a cement anchor. This bolt goes again in that hole there. Now, this bolt is pretty cool in the sense that. This piece down here, just like a drywall nail or screw, when you put that in to hang a picture or something, how it expands in the drywall to help hold it. Well, this kind of does a similar thing. This here piece will, will expand as, as you screw this piece down. So what happens is you put this in there, just like say, and then with this nut on, they recommend you screw this all the way to the top here just to make hammering easier. Then you hammer it down into the cement. Well, you would also have a, an epoxy down in there to help hold it even tighter. But you do that, and then obviously the washer's on top. And then you do that, and then what ends up happening is that piece down there expands just enough that it grips into the cement. And then with the epoxy you put in there, piece of cake. So yeah, you got to drill a hole in the cement, but pretty uh, pretty nifty. So if you buy a VersaTube, tell them you want the cement anchors, those cement bolts, and have a buddy or yourself just make a bunch of rebar ones if you prefer that. Because these things here, I actually bought extra of these, and when I bought extra of these, they're only like two bucks a piece. You go to a hardware store and try to buy this thing, psh, it ain't two bucks. So it was it was pretty inexpensive. So get extras of these and uh, and you can use them for other projects. The VersaTube. I think it's kind of cool. It's like a Lego set putting it together. It was made in Casa Grande, Arizona. I went to pick it up myself on that trailer I showed you earlier and uh, or I could have had it delivered 
The big box store also has it. The only difference is by going through Versa 2 myself, I had more options on sizes and more options on colors of roof. And uh and they would deliver it for like three or fifty bucks or I could pick it up for free. And as I showed you earlier in the video, as long as you got a flatbed trailer, that one was a 5x12 and it holds a thousand pounds, you're good to go. So really the longest piece we had in there was 10 foot and that was the uh, tops, the, uh, the uh, roof, the metal roofing. So and I got green, you'll see that later when I put it all together, but first the tube.